Welcome to this channel Gain Java Knowledge and today in this video we are going to learn how to replace if else conditions with map in Java and which is better approach. Okay, let's start to write the code. So here I have just created one class and inside this class I have declared one main method. Okay, let me add one function here with multiple if else if else if conditions. So here I have just declared one method that is get juice and inside this get juice we can see multiple conditions if condition else if else if and else there are four conditions so let me generate methods for these functions so there is process apple juice create method and process apple juice coconut juice so here I have just created these three methods so let me return some value from here coconut juice is ready let me copy this statement and just paste it here in the apple juice so just replace apple and inside orange juice function we will just replace coconut with orange so here we have declared three methods so how we can call this get choose method so let me create object for this class and let me call this function and we'll just print the output that we will get from this function so here i will use system.out.println and here i will call object dot get choose and here I will just pass the value of orange so let me run this application and we'll check the output so here we can see inside this function there are multiple conditions and there are three functions that we are using inside this application process coconut juice apple juice and orange juice these three functions so let me run so here we can see the output is orange juice is ready if i will replace the value apple so we will check the output it will process the another function so if the condition it will check the condition if the condition match with apple so it will call this function and we will get apple juice is ready this is the output that we are getting based on our input parameter for this function So now the requirement is we want to remove multiple if else condition. So these conditions we just want to remove and we want to go with map instead of if else condition. We can go with switch also but it is not going to give a clean and robust code. So we can go with map. So let me remove these conditions. So here I have just removed from this get juice function if we want to go with map so which map we need to use so here i will just declare one map if we are going with uh, string literal then we can use hash map if we want to use enums then we can use enum map so here we have only key as a string value that is orange mango so we can go with hash map so let me declare one map here final map and its key is string and here we will use supplier function because we just want to execute our logic so here i had some mistake final string so here we just need to use supplier and this supplier will be string type so here we will just pass string because here we want to process our logic so here it is map it is final so we just need to initialize inside our constructor or before constructor so let me create the constructor for this class and inside this constructor i will just initialize this map and here we are going to use hash map because we are going to use literal string so here i will just put the value map dot put here our key will be orange 
and based on this key we want to process the logic so here i will just call the function this dot process orange juice so this is our logic that is value so let me add three times because we have three string letter third is coconut and let me replace this process apple process coconut so here i have just added three values inside this map so how we will call this map now so let me go inside our get juice function so we have already removed all if else condition so here we just need to add one condition to check if map dot contains key that we are passing from here as input parameter fruit if it is exist then we will just get and return the response map dot get object based on its key so our key is fruit and then we will just call get function to get its output in the else condition we can just add return no juice so let me run this application so here we are passing apple so we will just get the same output apple juice is ready so let me replace so here we will just pass coconut and let me run this application so now here we can see coconut juice is ready so once we will call get juice function it will go inside this and it will check if map contains this key so here we can see coconut is already available inside our map so it will just check its key is available then based on its key it will get the object and then it will get its output and will return the output so these three functions are same that we used in within if else condition also so like this we can use map instead of if else conditions so like this instead of going with multiple if conditions we are going with the map uh, so make sure your conditions fit with the map so instead of writing logic handling for each case we had a map and we can put um, the case and the logic as key value pair uh, so hence we can retrieve the logic from the map based on our key so okay thanks for watching this video